Truitt's Garage Doors in Leoma, Tennessee is your one stop for new garage door installations for all commercial and residential buildings, plus they offer full service on all existing doors. Call the pros today at Truitt's Garage Doors, 931-201-6464. From the Tennessee Valley Weather Channel, this is your afternoon update. Good Monday afternoon to you. I'm Kelly Rawson here in the Tennessee Valley Weather Center. We have quiet weather here in the Tennessee Valley, but of course, everybody is talking about what once was Hurricane Debbie at Landfalls, now weakened to a tropical storm, but Debbie is not done wreaking havoc over the southeast coast of the United States. We'll talk about Debbie and how Debbie can potentially impact our weather here in the Tennessee Valley. But for the next few days, expect pretty calm conditions. In fact, expect hot and humid conditions for us here locally. Expect a mostly sunny to partly cloudy sky this afternoon. I can't completely rule out a stray shower, the smallest shower possible forming this afternoon. Less than a 10% chance, but I do have to mention it. Again, most of us will stay dry, if not all of us, for this afternoon. For tonight, expect temperatures to cool down from the 90s back into the 80s and 70s overnight. Maybe some patchy fog out there, but it should be smooth sailing for a lot of us. We are going to be with a mostly sunny to partly cloudy sky once again for Tuesday. We will be dry on Tuesday and a little bit hotter heading into this afternoon or for Tuesday afternoon, I should say, likely into the upper 90. So add a few degrees to what Futurecast is showing. Now for the next few days, we are going to have this cold front not really do anything or impact us in any way, but it may act as a barrier to keep the remnants of Debbie away from us. I'll go ahead and step off the screen just so you can kind of see where Debbie is going to kind of meander over the next few days. It's looking to hug the Carolina coast. Now, some models have it more on a west word track, and the more west that the remnants of Debbie are, the higher chance we have for cloud cover, rainfall, all of that kind of stuff. But right now it's still looking to stay to our west. We have just a stray rain chance Thursday through Saturday to account for the potential for those remnants. And of course we are giving you a first heads up right now with the potential for a more westward track with the remnants of Debbie. But again, right now rain chances will be minimal. They may have to go up and they may go down just depending on what situation and scenario plays out. But we will of course keep you updated on that. Just know we at least may increase the cloud cover towards the end of this week, if not the rain chances. Otherwise, just a stray chance, especially for you folks. The more east you are in our viewing area, the higher chance you are going to have for those few showers to swirl through Thursday through Saturday. Now temperatures for the next few days are going to remain hot and humid into the mid to upper 90s, 97 and 98 for Tuesday and Wednesday. Again, if we see a more westward track, our temperatures will likely lower a little bit. And because we're just going to see more cloud cover and maybe even some rainfall as opposed to uh, partly cloudy to mostly sunny skies. So we will keep you updated on the potential for Debbie's remnants to impact us here in the Tennessee Valley. But again, for the next few days, just expect hot, humid and dry conditions. Mostly sunny to partly cloudy for this afternoon, lower to mid 90s for southern middle Tennessee and mid 90s expected for North Alabama with a mostly sunny sky for you folks as well. Here's a look at your seven day forecast again for the next few days, mostly sunny to partly cloudy, but then heading into Thursday through Saturday is when we could potentially see those remnants of what once was Hurricane Debbie now weak into a tropical storm. We have a stray chance on the board for now. We may have to increase those chances. We will, of course, let you know. And with the increase in rain chances, we will also decrease the temperatures. Let's look at your local weather forecast. Fred will be back this afternoon with another update.